What's going on YouTube? Thank you for watching another Geeks tutorial video. And today we're gonna be showing you how to speed up your Windows 10 for free and without using any software. So let's begin the quick tutorial. Stay tuned. Step number one, power option. Just go to your stop menu and search power option. Now you will see the power option on the result. Just click on it and you will get to this control panel power option window. Here you can see my default power plan is set as balanced. Change it to high performance. Now you can close the power option. Step number two, disable unwanted startup programs. For that, first you need to go to the task manager. The easiest way to get to the task manager is by clicking on any empty space on your taskbar and choose task manager from here. Once you're at the task manager, go to startup and here you will see all the programs that start up automatically when your system starts. When you install a program in Windows 10, it may add a small program that runs when Windows starts. After installing a lot of software, Software, you may experience your boot up process could become slow as well as these programs run on the system background forever and it's cause your system performance slow down. If there are programs you don't use much, they probably don't need to start up every time Windows tests. So I will show you how to disable unwanted startup programs to achieve a better startup speed and system performance. And you can see here many programs that we regularly use as well as many programs that we never use on a daily basis. Identify them and apply this. For example, if you are not an active Skype user, you can disable Skype from automatic startup once your system starts up. And let me disable a number of other programs as well that I ain't use regularly. And make sure do not disable your programs published by Microsoft Corporation because maybe these programs running your windows. And do not disable the antivirus too. That's it, we all done sure. Now close the task manager and let's move on to some other things. Step number 3, defragment and optimize drives. To do that you wanna go to start menu and search defragment. And click on defragment and optimize drives. Now you will see this window. From here you're gonna wanna select your system drive, usually it is C drive so let's select C and click on optimize. Now you can see your system drive is optimizing, once it's finished you can close the window. Step number 4, delete unnecessary temporary files. For that head over to the start menu and right click on windows icon, then choose run from here. Now type percentage temp percentage and click on ok. Now you will see this folder, select everything in it and delete. Now you can close the folder and go to the run box again by right clicking on the windows icon and choose run. Now type temp D -E -M -P, and click on ok. Now again a folder will appear and here you will see a dialog box just like this. Click on continue then select all the files in it, right click and delete. Now again go to run. And this time let's type prefetch. P R E F E T C H. Now click on OK. You will find all these commands that I mentioned on this video will be on the video description. So you can just copy and use them after you finish watching this video as well. Now click on continue. And you're gonna wanna select everything and delete. After that, you can close the folder. Step number five clean up memory. Go to your file explorer, right click on your system drive or C drive, or more specifically, saying where your windows 10 is installed and choose properties from here if you're now on the general tab, here you will see the disk cleanup option. Just click on it and allow it to scan the files. Now you can see the scanning is finished and you're gonna wanna click on the cleanup system files and it will scan again. After the scan finished, you will see this window. Now click on OK and it will ask you, are you sure you want to permanently delete this file? Just click on OK. Don't worry, it will only delete the unnecessary files. And what this is doing right now is cleaning all the unnecessary files in your system. Now the cleaning process Process has been done. Now let's move on to the step number 6, reduce runtime service. For that, first we wanna open the run box by right clicking on the windows icon and choose run. And you wanna type in msconfig, msconfig, then click on ok. And you will see this. And from here, go to service. Now you're gonna wanna check on this box, hide all Microsoft services. That's really important, I don't want you to delete any important things accidentally. So make sure you tick this option. Now click on OK. Step number 7. Registry tweaks. Now we'll show you how to do some registry tweaks to speed up your Windows 10. First thing you're gonna wanna do is launch your run box again. For that head over to the windows icon right click on it and choose run. Then 
then type in reg edit r e g e d i t and click on ok now you will see this window and from here you're gonna wanna go to h key current user just click on it and then go to control panel and double click on the mouse folder now double click on mouse hover time option and change its value to 10 then click on ok now double click on desktop folder scroll down a little bit then double click on mouse show delay and change its value to 10 then click on ok now we just increase the mouse respawn time to experience all these changes you should want to restart your system let's restart it a little bit later because i have to show one more thing to speed up your windows 10. stay tuned step number eight visual effects in this final step we are going to show you how to disable your windows 10 interface graphical performance to boost your system performance and please note it won't affect your gaming graphics or your program graphics it will only reduce the graphics performance of your windows 10 os for example after you do this you may feel lows in your visual effect on your windows 10 but it will improve your system performance to the maximum level so the final decision is up to you whatever it is for the sake of the video i will show you how to do it try it on if you want if you feel disappointing you can always change it back to normal stage later so let's start move on to your start menu and search system now click on it and you will get to this window now click on the advanced system settings hyperlink on the left side then you will get to this small window and here you will find this settings button under performance visual effects processor scheduling memory usage and virtual memory just click on this settings button and you will get to this performance option window these settings are basically everything that make your windows 10 look beautiful as well as these are the main things that uses your computer resources like your ram processing power and graphics as well i only recommend this if you want the extreme performance that possible with your machine so let's do it click on adjust for best performance option and you can see it will automatically uncheck all these settings if you want you can select some of the options that you can't live without for example in my case i would like to take this option show shadows under mouse pointer that's it once you're done edit just click on apply and ok now let's take a proper system restart back again so that's it guys that's how you can speed up your windows 10 if you like this video leave a thumbs up if you want to watch more videos like this always stay subscribed and show us the love by sharing this content you can always comment your experience with this video it will help more people to find this video is good or bad you can also ask questions suggestion or doubt we will definitely replay each and every comment you leave this is amar rafi from geeks tutorial see you guys on the next one peace out